Thanks for watching this video on a proposed annual budget. Uh, what you're looking at on your screen is actually just one example of how a proposed annual budget could look. Uh, this one's kind of interesting because it actually uh, takes into consideration what was proposed and budgeted for in the previous year, what was actually spent in the previous year, and what you're proposing moving forward. Uh, so you'll notice that it's broken down. This column right here is what was proposed and budgeted last year. And this column is what you actually spent last year. Uh, and then what you're proposing for the upcoming year. And it also gives you the uh, luxury of adding some comments to each of those line items. Uh, so you can better explain what those expenses were. Uh, down here in this box is your summary. So it talks about what you currently have on hand, uh, what your expected revenue is, so your total expected funds, uh, what any uh, other obligations that you're planning for the upcoming year, uh, and then uh, leaves you with your undesignated surplus. This smaller box right here, uh, again, is just highlighting your expected revenue, and it breaks it down what, the, what those expectations are. Uh, so in this particular case of this chapter, they really only expect to gain revenue in two areas, which is dues and the rebates. Uh, and then it also gives you one other freeform common area where you can add any additional comments uh, there. Uh, perhaps the date that it was, the budget was voted on and approved by the membership. Uh, so that basically rounds off this presentation of this proposed annual budget.